August 13th, 2015. When's no, it's Thursday. 9:30 in the morning. This is Spanky. Spanky's our daycare dog. Comes every Thursday. That's why I knew it was Thursday. I was going to say Wednesday. Okay, you're wet. Don't lean on me. I don't want to get all full. Uh, 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 uh. You've been playing in the water. Sit. Sit. Sit that rear end down. And then you get closer to me. Gosh. This is what Spanky looks like when Spanky comes, all nice and white. And it'll be dirt color. When Spanky goes home tonight. Well, a lot of work with these two uh, boxers. Female here has been okay. The male is intact. As you can see. I haven't shot any videos since uh, the last ones. I've been just working my butt off trying to counter the testosterone that's built up. Ugh. Some of you know, Jessica's on her first solo vacation. She, uh, she's a beautiful young lady and she set out for three weeks. No family vacation, so she's safe and sound, visiting friends and her brother. So I've been busy here running, running the shop. So I apologize for not getting any uh, videos out earlier. Rudy, you're tired finally, huh? You're tired. And Moochie. Moochie's been playing like crazy. Moochie's tired. I don't know if I'm saying it right. I think it's M-O-C-H-I-N. I gotta go look at the spelling again. Moochie. Yeah, you're cutie. You've been having fun. But those two have been a handful. I reread the uh, form submission and uh, he's getting his, well she's getting fixed uh, this next month and then he, as soon as he turns one, I guess it is, he's going to get fixed. They want him to grow out, which I understand, but man, if he wasn't uh, slated to be cut, then uh, I wouldn't take him back. Just too much of a handful. When I say Spanky was all wet, that's why Spanky's all wet. Look at Diving underwater, dripping wet. <laughs> Fortunately, up here in Tehachapi, we're at 4,000 foot elevation, so we don't get that uh, that hot. Nothing like Mojave or Bakersfield or LA. LA's been blazing, I understand. I think we may see 88 today. But if it gets too warm, then we head into the house. It's all air conditioned. They've been getting up at 5.30 in the morning before the sun. Just as the sun's breaking, they've been getting up and running outside and playing. So, uh... And in the middle of the day, all they want to do is take a siesta and sleep because it's too hot to do anything. So we all go inside and then I take a siesta. It's been nice. I just put the clothes sign up out front. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I've been up against. Good thing Spanky's a good sport. Ah, I'm tired.
I think this is, uh, let me say, one of Jessica's mistakes. She gave them a real good price. Didn't realize they were intact, which adds a lot more stress to, to us when we do cage-free dog boarding. So, uh, I mean, I want the dogs out running around playing, burning off energy. But when they're intact, they just can't help themselves. Right, buddy? Right? See, these guys want to play, and this guy just wants to hump. Play, hump. Play, hump. And trust me, if Spanky wanted to lay into Mr. Humper, Spanky could. Spanky's a real good mellow dog, American Bulldog, for those who are wondering. Some people think it's a pit bull, but it's an American Bulldog. And he plays and plays and plays. He's been coming to us for over a year. And that's all that one wants to do. Okay guys, I'm done. I can't shoot the video. Gonna have to put somebody into another yard. Even when I walk up to you, you just can't seem to get it. All right. That's what I'm saying. It just wore me out. We had a lot of dogs over the last uh, couple of weeks. And uh, Jessica being gone, I had to do a lot of work. And didn't feel like coming out here and videotaping, quite frankly, because of this guy. Too busy out here trying to keep an eye on everybody and making sure everyone stays safe. And we had no problems. <laughs> it's so cute when the Rudy jumps through the hole. You can go back and look at that. There's a tunnel through there. Right there. <laughs> I was watching. Who was it? They were just chasing each other like crazy. And Rudy kept jumping through the hole. And the other dog's like, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? All right, I gotta stop it. One more view. That's what I'm up against. Country Oaks Bed and Biscuit Inn, where there's always room at the end for your good doggy if it doesn't have its balls. Farm Paul signing off.